Welcome to our YouTube channel where we explore the world of rare fruits. Join us as we discover exotic and unique fruits from around the globe. From the spiky and vibrant durian to the sweet and tangy soursop, we'll introduce you to some of the rarest and most fascinating fruits you've ever seen. Get ready to expand your taste buds and your knowledge with us. Jabuticaba is a type of fruit that grows on the trunk and branches of the Jabuticabera or Brazilian grape tree. The fruit is native to Brazil and is highly valued in Brazilian cuisine for its unique flavor. It has a purple-black skin and a white pulp that can be eaten fresh or made into jams, jellies, juices, liqueurs, or wine. The fruit is similar to a grape but with a thicker skin and a more acidic and spicy flavor. The Jabuticaba tree belongs to the Myrtacea family and is evergreen and slow-growing. It can be grown in pots or as a bonsai and requires medium to high sun exposure. It can thrive in a wide range of soil mediums, but if the soil has a high pH, additional fertilization may be required. It is generally recommended to feed the tree three times a year with a complete fertilizer, and additional care may be necessary for iron deficiencies. Rambutan is a fruit native to Southeast Asia and is also commonly grown in other tropical regions. It is produced by a medium-sized tree in the family Sapindacea, which is closely related to several other edible tropical fruits, such as lychee, longan, pulisan, and ginup. The fruit is round or oval and about the size of a golf ball. It has a red or yellow skin that is covered with soft hairs, which gives it the appearance of a hairy lychee. The skin is removed to reveal the translucent white flesh that surrounds a large seed. The flesh is sweet and juicy with a taste similar to grapes or lychees. Rambutan is rich in vitamin C and antioxidants, and it has several potential health benefits such as improving digestion and reducing inflammation. Rambutan is typically eaten fresh, but it can also be used in desserts, salads, and other dishes. Rambutan seeds are also used in traditional medicine to treat various ailments such as fever and diarrhea. Lufa, also known as luffa, is a type of gourd that grows on vines with dark green foliage and yellow blossoms. It belongs to the genus Luffa of tropical and subtropical vines in the pumpkin, squash, and gourd family. The term Lufa commonly refers to the fruits of the species Luffa aegyptiaca and Luffa acutangula. When harvested at a young stage, the Lufa is edible and used in many soups and stir-fried dishes. It is popular in Vietnam, as well as other countries such as India, China, and Bangladesh. In Vietnam, Lufa farming is most prevalent in the Mekong Delta region, where the climate is favorable for the plant's growth. The lufas are usually grown on trellises or on the ground and require plenty of water to thrive. Lufa is also used in traditional medicine in Vietnam, as it is believed to have various health benefits including improving digestion and reducing inflammation. Additionally, the seeds of the lufa plant are used to make a type of oil that is used in cooking and skincare products. Purple akebi fruit is a rare and exotic fruit that grows on a semi-evergreen vine native to Japan, China and the Korean Peninsula. It has a thick, spongy and purple skin that encloses a translucent, gelatinous flesh with many small black seeds. The flesh has a mild, sweet and slightly bitter taste, with notes of pear, coconut and melon, while the seeds add some crunchiness. The fruit is usually eaten raw by scooping out the flesh with a spoon, but the skin can also be cooked as a vegetable. Purple akebi fruit is considered a symbol of autumn in rural Japan, where it is sometimes offered to ancestors on Buddhist altars. In Japan, the akebi fruit is often used in desserts such as ice cream, jelly, and fruit compote. It can also be eaten raw or used in salads. The fruit is a good source of vitamins and minerals, including vitamin C, vitamin A, and potassium. Buddha's hand, also known as fingered citron, is a citrus fruit that is believed to have originated in India or China. It gets its name from its distinctive shape, which resembles the hand of Buddha with curled fingers. The fruit usually contains no pulp, juice, or seeds, and its shape resembles a hand with multiple splayed fingers. According to tradition, Buddha prefers the fingers of the fruit to be in a position where they resemble a closed rather than open hand, as closed hands symbolize the act of prayer to Buddha. In China, the Buddha's hand fruit is a symbol of happiness, longevity, and good fortune. It is also a traditional temple offering and a New Year's gift. In addition to its symbolic and cultural significance, Buddha's hand is also used as an ingredient in cooking and is valued for its fragrant, aromatic zest. It can be used in a variety of dishes, including desserts, salads, and cocktails. Buddha's hand is also used in traditional Chinese medicine for its supposed health benefits, such as relieving coughs and reducing phlegm. Overall, Buddha's hand is a unique and versatile fruit with cultural, culinary, and medicinal significance.
The hala fruit, also known as pandanus or scrupine fruit, is a tropical fruit that is native to the Pacific Islands, including Hawaii. It is a large fruit that is typically oval in shape and can grow up to 12 inches in length. The hala fruit is made up of numerous segments called cones and is found in Southeast Asia, Eastern Australia, Pacific Islands, and Hawaii. The fruit looks like an exploding planet and tastes like sugarcane. The hala fruit is unique in appearance with a hard, spiky exterior that must be removed before eating. Inside, the fruit fruit is segmented and contains a juicy, translucent pulp that is often compared to a cross between pineapple and coconut in flavor. The tree that produces this fruit is called the hala fruit tree, which is one of the 750 or so trees that belong to the pandanus species. The hala fruit tree grows upright and can reach a height of 414 meters with a single trunk that is slender with brown ring bark. The tree is spiny and can grow to a width of 4.5 to 11 meters and forks at a height of 4.8 meters. The hala fruit is used in a variety of ways, including as a food source, medicine, and even as a material for weaving baskets and mats. In Hawaii, the hala fruit is often used in traditional dishes like poi, and the leaves of the hala tree are also used in cultural practices and ceremonies. The hala fruit is an important part of Pacific Island culture and cuisine, and its unique flavor and appearance make it a fascinating fruit to learn about and try. Guarana is a climbing plant that is native to the Amazon basin and is especially common in Brazil. Three. The plant's seeds contain caffeine, theobramin, tannins, saponins, catechins, and other compounds that have antioxidant properties. In fact, guarana has among the highest concentrations of caffeine in any plant and may contain up to 3.6% to 5.8% caffeine by weight, whereas coffee only has up to 2%. Guarana is best known for its stimulating effects and ability to reduce fatigue and improve focus. Its seeds have been used for centuries by indigenous Amazonian tribes for their energizing properties, and guarana is now a popular ingredient in energy drinks and supplements. Additionally, guarana has been found to have other potential health benefits, including reducing the risk of cardiovascular disease, improving mental performance, and aiding weight loss. However, more research is needed to fully understand the effects of guarana on these health outcomes. The fruit of the Monstera deliciosa plant is known as a tasty tropical treat. It has been described as having a taste similar to a combination of pineapple, banana, and mango with a coconut-like flavor that makes it even more refreshing. It is also known as the fruit salad plant because it can be used in conjunction with many other sweet fruits to create a delicious and healthy salad. However, when it isn't ripe, it can give you a blast of oxalic acid, which can cause irritation to the mouth and throat. So it's important to make sure that the fruit is ripe before consuming it. In its native growing region, the fruit is known as the Mexican breadfruit and is used in many traditional dishes. The texture of the fruit is similar to that of a ripe avocado, with soft and creamy flesh, which makes it easy to enjoy with nothing more than a spoon. Mangosteen, Garcinia mangostana, is an exotic, tropical fruit with a slightly sweet and sour flavor. It's originally from Southeast Asia, but can also be found in various tropical regions around the world, such as Southwest India, Colombia, and Puerto Rico. The fruit is sometimes referred to as purple mangosteen because of the deep purple color its rind develops when ripe. In contrast, the juicy inner flesh is bright white and has been described as a mix of lychee, peach, strawberry, and pineapple. Research on mangosteen suggests that it can contains anthins, which are compounds that have potential anti-cancer effects, as indicated by test tube and animal studies. Additionally, mangosteen has been touted for its potential weight loss benefits. Although research is limited and inconclusive, some studies have shown that mangosteen may have a positive effect on weight loss. Soursop, also known as graviola, is a tropical fruit that is native to Central and South America, the Caribbean, and parts of Africa. It is also cultivated in Southeast Asia and other tropical regions around the world. The fruit is typically oval or heart-shaped and can weigh up to 15 pounds, 7 kilograms. Its outer skin is green and prickly, while the flesh is white, creamy, and juicy, with a flavor that is often described as a combination of pineapple, strawberry, and citrus. Soursop is rich in vitamins C and B, as well as minerals such as calcium, magnesium, and potassium. It also contains antioxidants, which may help protect against cellular damage and lower the risk of chronic diseases. In addition to its culinary uses, soursop has been traditionally used in herbal medicine to treat a variety of ailments, including infections, fever, and digestive issues. 
The Australian finger lime or caviar lime is a thorny understory shrub or small tree native to the lowland subtropical rainforest and rainforest and the coastal border region of Queensland and New South Wales, Australia. It has edible fruits, which are under development as a commercially sold crop. The fruit is cylindrical, 4-8 cm long, sometimes slightly curved, and comes in different colors including pink and green. The globular juice vesicles have been likened to a lime caviar, which can be used as a garnish or added to various recipes. Sure. The Australian finger lime plant is 2-7 meters in height. The leaves are small, 1-6 centimeters long and 3-25 millimeters wide, glabrous, with a notch tip and crenate towards the apex. Flowers are white with petals 6-9 millimeters long. The fresh vesicles have the effect of a burst of effervescent tangy flavor as they are chewed. Oh, very tart but super crunchy. The fruit juice is acidic and similar to that of a lime. Marmalade and pickles are also made from finger lime. Finger lime peel can be dried and used as a flavoring spice. Miracle fruit is a tropical berry also known as Sincepalum dulcificum. The fruit is native to West Africa and has been used for centuries by locals to sweeten sour or bitter foods. The fruit contains a glucoprotein called miraculin, which binds to the taste buds on the tongue and alters their perception of taste. When the fruit is consumed, it causes sour or bitter foods to taste sweet. This effect can last for up to two hours. Miracle fruit is commonly used in flavor tripping parties, where participants eat the fruit and then sample various sour or bitter foods, such as lemons, limes, and vinegar. The experience is said to be similar to eating candy, with the sourness replaced by sweetness. While the fruit itself is not particularly nutritious, it has gained popularity in recent years as a natural sweetener and flavor enhancer. It is often used by people looking to reduce their sugar intake or to add variety to their diets. The African horn cucumber, also known as horn melon, spiked melon, jelly melon, or kawano, is an annual vine in the cucumber and melon family cucurbitacea. Its fruit has horn-like spines, hence the name horn melon. The ripe fruit has orange skin and lime green, jelly-like flesh. The African horn cucumber is a traditional food plant indigenous to southern and central Africa. It grows naturally in Namibia, Botswana, South Africa and Swaziland. Today it is grown for its ornamental and edible fruits all over the world, including New Zealand. Island, where it was registered under the trademark Kawano. It has many health benefits. For example, it contains a variety of essential nutrients, such as vitamin C, vitamin A, vitamin B6, magnesium, iron, phosphorus, zinc, potassium and calcium. It also provides several potent antioxidants, such as vitamin C, vitamin A, zinc and lutein. Aki is a fruit that grows on evergreen trees and is available throughout the year, most abundantly in Jamaica, where it is so revered as the national fruit. It grows on a tropical evergreen tree that's native to West Africa and also goes by the names Aki, Aki, and Aki apple. It is also known as Anki or Aa, Blaea sapida, and is a fruit of the Sapindacea, soapberry, family, as are the lychee and the longan. Aki is the national fruit of Jamaica and is considered a delicacy. Its fruit is fully developed, ripe, and suitable for cooking when the pods are bright red and they split open easily to expose the edible fruit inside. Jamaicans will often say that the fruit will yawn or smile open naturally on its own before it's ready to be picked from the tree. The pot opens to expose three or four cream-colored sections of flesh called arils, underneath large, glossy black seeds. The arils are what you eat. Aki requires a little bit of prep work before it can be eaten. Simply remove the black seeds from the flesh, along with the red lining on each section of flesh. Discard these parts. What you want is the flesh itself. Rinse the flesh in tap water and drain it well before you use it in cooking. Durian is a tropical fruit known for its large size, unique odor, and thorn-covered rind. It's nicknamed the king of fruits in Southeast Asia, where it's commonly associated with the cuisine of countries such as Indonesia, Malaysia, Singapore, Thailand, Cambodia, Philippines, Bangladesh, and Vietnam. Durian is very high in nutrients compared to most other fruits. Durian is the edible fruit of several tree species belonging to the genus Durio. There are 30 recognized Durio species, at least nine of which produce edible fruit. Durio zabethanus is 
is the only species available in the international market. The fruit can grow as large as 30 centimeters, 12 inches long and 15 centimeters, 6 in in diameter, and it typically weighs 1 to 3 kilograms, 2 to 7 pounds. Its shape ranges from oblong to round, the color of its husk green to brown, and its flesh pale yellow to red, depending on the species. It has a hard, spiky exterior that needs to be carefully opened to reveal the soft, creamy flesh inside. The flesh of the durian is typically pale yellow or white, and has a creamy texture that is often described as custard-like. The flavor of durian is complex and difficult to describe, with some people loving its sweet, slightly nutty taste, while others find it too overpowering and unpleasant. Oof. One of the most distinctive features of durian is its strong odor, which has been described as everything from sweet and floral to rotten and putrid. Some people find the smell so offensive that it is banned in some public places and hotels in Southeast Asia. However, durian lovers argue that the smell is an essential part of the fruit's appeal and that it adds to its unique flavor.